Hi, I'm Jim Kohler, owner of FireShield, and I'm here to introduce you to an exciting new product that I developed, the Easy Access Grease Duct Door. So we all know the shortcomings of the grease duct doors that are currently on the market, and that inspired me to come up with the Easy Access Door. Um, I wanted something that was not only UL liquid tight and code compliant in every direction. I wanted it to be pre-insulated, and I wanted it to open at the plane of the wrap. Everything is captive on it, nothing gets removed, and I want to show you how easy it is to install and get inside the duct. All right, we are going to install a six by 10 easy access door. So in order to do that, we cut the hole in the duct at seven inches by 11. So one inch extra from the size of the door. I'm now going to take the base mounting plate and take the relief paper off. Come on. And we're gonna set this Take it inside the duct, and then we are going to center it in the duct. And then we're going to compress it and let the tape do its job in holding it in place. So now the frame is inside the duct, and everything on the outside here is flush with the duct. It's a uh, centering device. So now the base mounting plate is in. We're now going to take the frame, and we're going to center it over the base mounting plate. And and we're screwing in through the frame into the base mounting plate, which is sandwiching the duct in between it. There we go, we have the frame is all set. Then we're going to take the grease plate and we're gonna take that in, we're gonna slide it in vertically into that steel channel that is part of the uh, side frame. And then once we get to that point and it's all the way in, we're gonna give it a shove and what that'll do is that locks that silicone gasket, it'll fold back in and that what is what makes it grease tight. So now we're going to take a little break and we're going to let the insulation guys come in and do their thing if I can find them. And then we will uh, finish up the installation. All right, we're back. It looks like our insulators did a fine job. They cut their wrap and they butted into the frame. Um, no need to tape any of the wrap, so the wrap guys really like that. And so we are now ready to put on the outside cover. Let me grab that. And this is going to get screwed into the holes on the side frame. And we are gonna set, I'll set one screw. Now we're gonna wanna compress this because the wrap is tight to the door. And so we are compress it a little bit. Don't let the screws do all the work. Now the cover assembly is installed and everything is looking good. The uh, wrap guy will continue with his layout and his banding. Nothing gets interrupted. Now we're going to check and make sure the inside's secure and we have a nice reveal around the door. The gasket plate itself should be about a half an inch and looks all set. We're now gonna close the cover plate and we're gonna tighten it down with the captive screws can't get removed, can't fall down 30 feet. So there we go, and we're done. So along comes the cleaner, he wants to get in and clean this thing. A couple quick turns on the quick access fasteners. He opens it up, he takes the grease plate, slides it out. You're now cleaning your duct in a matter of seconds. So when you're done, time to close back up. Can put it in vertically, give it a nice shove, make sure it's even all the way around. And off they go to the next one.